Hi, I'm Jonathan. I'm here with Food Grads, and I'm here at Lady York Foods with two butchers, uh, these two strapping young gentlemen over here. Can I get a, li a little introduction from the two of you? Hi, how are you? Thanks for coming by. It's uh, Tony. And I'm Don. All right, I'm just here to, I, we, we're just here to wonder about, you know, what's it like being a butcher, how long you guys have been in the industry, and if you have any advice for any young people actually thinking about becoming a butcher. So tell us your stories. Well, I started off at about uh, 19 years old, just uh, serving behind the counter, doing chicken prep and other preps. And then as I got a little older, I wanted to get into the field. So I asked one of the managers, and uh, he said, there's a course you can take actually at George Brown College, two-year course, which... Uh, as of today, it's uh, learning different cuts and learning different types of meats, different grades, different ages. And uh, yeah, as, as today I says, uh, I love the, the field and I'm still doing it. And uh, you learn a lot and know what to eat and what not to eat. That's awesome. That's great to hear. How about you, Donnie? I just started a few years ago and uh, I learned the hard way. Cutting something, if I made a mistake, my hand got slapped with a knife. <laughs> so I learned quickly how to do it the right way. And I've just been doing it for about uh, five years now. Well, that's, that's really funny. Uh, how, uh, any, what's the best part about your job, you think? Uh, the best part is, is different things. Mm -hmm. Getting to meet people, um, loving what you do. As like Donnie says, you make a mistake, you learn the hard way. But uh, as I'm on the opposite side, I've been doing it for a long time, maybe about 19, 20 years. And uh, you still learn how to make money, how to grow in the business. And it just for advice, it, it's a bit harder as opposed to getting it done years ago. Because um, now things are, kids are getting, uh, learning different things, want to do different things. Now you get a lot of plumbers, electrician, um, well, how can I say, computer industry. So this business is dying a bit I don't see that many butchers coming up. They're going more down as we're getting older. But uh, anybody want to join, you know, come by and you can be taught on the spot. It takes a little, little time to do that. Or you can take a course, which is good. That's yeah. great advice. How about you, Donnie? Any, anything you really love about your job? Uh, the best thing about the job is the people. The people I work with and dealing with the customers. I really like dealing with people. Uh, for anybody who's interested in getting into it, it's it's a great way to earn a living. The hours can be a little bit long at times, the work a little bit heavy, but at the end of the day, it's all worth it and you feel like you've accomplished something. Thank you for that. And uh, one last question, of course, everyone's probably going to wonder, what's the worst part about the job? Because obviously, each job has their pros and their cons. My worst part is... Uh cutting myself <laughs> <laughs> that would be uh, painful <laughs> um the dirtiness is dirtiness everywhere right mm -hmm. it could be on any any site <laughs> any job but yeah other, other than the cutting your finger or not cutting it yeah that's that would be my worst experience <laughs> you Donnie? Uh, the worst part of the job is when tony cuts me <laughs> <laughs> but uh other than that you know what it's uh it's like any other job it has its ups and downs but uh most of the time, it is a great job to have. All right. I really appreciate it from both of you. Thank you again. And that's basically our interview. Thank you, everyone, for stopping by and listening. Hopefully, you can like and subscribe this video. And tune in for some more interviews from Food Grads. Thank you.